out of it and I didn't eat very many snacks. So I need to fill up now. <laughs> awesome. Max and Susie are at the Admirals Club already. Oh really? Ross, you ready for Admirals Club? Are you, you ready? ready to go to the sure. club? I'm ready. Let's do it. Susie and I scored the back and it looks like it kind of filled up on us. It's a salad bar. Nothing oh, super nice. special, but they got like a vegetarian soup and then the grilled cheese or the macaroni and cheese. Awesome. Alright. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. I'll, I'll get in and I'll do All right. that. <laughs> you can tell them that and then doze it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Not when he's smoking us. Right. See you there. Thanks a lot. Thanks. Heading to South America, yeah, baby. Be there soon. South America in a bus. Yep. Susie's in the sleeping seat in the corner there. The mountain seems easy right now. <laughs> I think it'll be a cakewalk. We'll be in Santiago in about eight hours. We'll probably watch a couple of Netflix series. Yeah. Try to get some shut eye. Till then. Sounds good. All right. See you there. Chelsea and Russ made the 8.30 flight over to Mendoza. We didn't have enough time so to make our connection, so we uh, we had the 3 p.m. flight head over there today. So I'm gonna go find the VIP lounge and get some shut-eye. Aboard the last leg of our trip to Mendoza. Uh, we leave in about three minutes. We're coming back from Inca. Just paid our bills and. Yeah. and all right. <laughs> Should I use this? Paid all of our this. permit fees. And we're heading back. Heading back to the hotel. Neither. Just go naked. They're going to tell me to leave my sport fans over there. No.
with I'm with the fridge. Yeah. I'm Chelsea. Her and I, we are already rich to summit this season. So, that is a good deal for you because uh, we are already acclimatized. Sleeping bags, right? If the fleece is pink, yellow, uh, yellow kitty or frozen, I don't care. <coughs> right? So that is the more important thing, so you must check it, how is the quality, how is the that kind of thing. Uh, something like this. Yeah. And directly in your skin. Mm -hmm. After say two nights there. Okay, good. And uh, the day that we arrive, one night, plus a France trekking cover. Oh mm -hmm. yes. Trekking pants. You have some? Mm -hmm. Same thing. Okay. How many do you see have? I've got two. I've got a zero degree and a negative 20. And these with the liners. This is what I'm too Yeah, but at the end, it's bad boy. <laughs> so, we must have a balance between how much we must carry and how much we must offer. Cheers, everybody. We didn't live on a compound. We had an apartment. <laughs> Good little walk. Wine to drink? Wine? No, I just Malbec steak. Malbec steak. Malbec steak. Salad.
try the cracker sandwich. <laughs> I want you to eat it first. <laughs> I don't know. Guys, good luck to everybody. Um, welcome to Mendoza. Thank you. Cheers again. Cheers. This is the first sip of alcohol I've had in like three years. <laughs> so. Happy birthday to you. Guess what? That's wow. what the wish was, man. Yeah, that's good. Don't, don't yeah. say what the wish is. But you, you could like guess. See it. We have our first check-in here. After we continue with car until this point, it's two kilometers more, so it's one mile and point three. And from there we start walking, and we go to Confluencia. We have a bridge here, so so far in any point of the expedition we must cross a river. So far, no? So we go to Confluence. From here to here is three hours. Right? We spend the night here. Next day, next day we go to the viewpoint of Plaza Francia. Plaza Francia is here. Why we don't go to Plaza Francia, Plaza Francia? The first one is from the viewpoint to Plaza Francia we have two hours more and we only win 50 meters higher. Oh, no, so it's not a big deal. And after we have one hour more to go down to the viewpoint, point and after a few hours more to come back to Plaza France. There we spend another night. Go one back is around seven hours. No? And next day we go from Confluencia to Plaza de Amores. That also is the reason why we don't go there, because we're going to be exhausting and next day we have one of the longest days of the expedition. It's around nine hours. Could be seven, could be ten. I don't know. I don't see you walking yet, so I don't know how much could be. Next day we have rest, next day we go to Bonete, next day we have rest, and next day blah blah blah. blah. We have <laughs> come one here, come choose here. Camp 3 is here, around, on the summit of Aconcagua. So.
we're about a mile or so in on the trail up to Confluencia. It's pretty warm out, it's probably 60, 65 degrees, nice breeze. Uh, it's really dry out, super dry. So we drink lots of water, five liters a day. That's what we're told by our guide. You are going to prepare after the breakfast your own lunch for the way. Mm -hmm. The first day we give you, because we don't know your preference, and even we give you a sandwich, it is quite a lot for the day. But we really don't know what you like, what you don't, if you have any allergy or whatever at the, at the beginning. And also could be a good idea that you know your own sizes and how much you eat. For example, in my case, when I'm walking, just with a little bit of raisins and something like that is right the chocolate. We're off on our acquisition hike up to Plaza Francia. We'll be able to see the south face of Aconcagua, which is the dangerous side. Cliffs, glaciers, should be pretty awesome. Our Augustine, our guides, have about a seven hour day today. a big mass of ice? Yeah. Okay, that is Polish glacier. Oh. The salmon that we have near at the left. Okay. Yeah. Well, do you see the water spring? Oh yeah. At the side of that water spring was the first location of the uh, confluence. Confluence was moved by the side of the river. Even if we pay attention, there will still be in the spot for the tents and everything. But it also was a small place, the Confluencia, and it was also a quite dangerous position just in case if a 
the river is increasing from one moment to another. You know, the glaciers have lagoons inside, and sometimes that lagoon gets broken and releases the water. Tsunami move. And for that reason, they move confluence where it's now. Right, that's the Norwell, there is a big mass of ice. Yes. That is fully great. The small hill where we're going, and behind that we have a hole. No? So yeah. if you want we can go directly to the hole. From the hole we have a beautiful view also, so don't worry about that. Alright? We're 20 minutes from Plaza Francia Lookout. We are here, around, no? Yep. And you see, tomorrow we're gonna make most twice of the distance we make already. Mm -hmm. So today we're going to make the same distance, but the half of today is going down. So it's sometimes, normally it's not so difficult. And this condition, no? Like we saw, we have two summits, and <laughs> our summit is the right one. Your time. Last, <laughs> Susie's ready last thing, now. sorry. <laughs> Middle or big? No? This one in the shadow is Ibanez. Mm -hmm. This is Rico or Crocodile. Oh. Rico because Crocodile because it looks like a piece of Crocodile. Between Ibanez, in the shortest part of this, if you cross, this is a call. Two hours later you are in Plaza Argentina. Mm. Then another base camp. Oh. Oh, this Soup of milk and nuts. Great! Oh, 
<laughs> yeah. I was going to say, that's my be... favorite Whoa. term. <laughs> Oh, I had pumpkin soup a while back and said it was pretty good. Oh, thank you. Like a bisque? Mm -hmm. yeah. Oh, it's like a oh, chicken leg you. or something. Thank you. It's there. Mr. Joss, yes. Thank you. See you later, sir. Yeah. Uh, see you. Yeah, make sure you email us all. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Can I get the information? Yes, I'm staying five more minutes because I gotta finish with the paperwork. Okay. Safe Thank you, bud. You'll be all in the summit, it's okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Safe travels. Thank you. <laughs> I want you guys to do that for me. Sir. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Gracias. Gracias. Yummy food. Thank you. We're leaving on Confluencia on our trek to Plaza de Mulas. Yeah, I know. Yeah. About I'm, nine I'm to ten hour hike. You know. You're doing a good job. You're doing a good job. Good job. You don't have any. Where are you? I'm going to pick our stuff up right now.
was fun. Push to base camp. Plaza de Mulas. Feel good so far, right? Yeah. Feeling good so far, Emma? So far, so good. Rock and roll. Good mechanism. Brian? That's me. Brian, nice to meet you, Brian. Yeah. My name is Ariel. Ariel? Ariel, huh? Ariel. GH 199. Eh. Uh, Global Rescue. Ah, no. Mary. Mary Lee. Mary Lee. Robert. Yeah, Christopher. Christopher, nice to meet you. Good to meet you. Okay, welcome to Plaza de Mules. Gracias. Camden. Plaza de Mules. 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 I have to drink a lot of juice. Oh. Yes, or water or something. Oh, yeah. Because yes. it's too hot.
lost last night. I still got one. Oh, I got a pizza him about from the headache before I start dosing it. From last night, still. Yeah. Some and then I um. So then I no put a pack underneath the bed no milk and tilt it up like he was saying to do. So they are ranchers and, and human beings are. They would have like little uh, Tyrannosaurus like Rex, like herding. Yeah. yeah, like they were the cows. Mm -hmm. They're so bad. T Rex. <laughs> yeah. T Rex will be. You see there is a wave who's going up. We must cross one river. We continue on the moraine. We go stride and after we make the zigzags. And the last rocky part and we reach the summit. Normally it's going back like a seven hours. No? But no matter what we are going to start early tomorrow. One is because of the sun, because if not in the in the afternoon it's going to be like extremely warm. And after, like I told you, because of the river, we have we must cross one river. That this that one. Then going is not a big deal. We have a bridge. Now we cross normally, but the return with the heat, the river is coming like a bigger, and is covering the the bridge. So probably we gotta put the feet on the water for four steps only. The left one is uh, the summit of Okunko. Too far, far left. Yeah. Oh, we just have to go up there. No big deal. That one? It's just right there. Far left. That it just seems like a problem. The fact that we, get we have like three big sticks. Uh, no? Okay. okay. I, 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 my yeah. heart rate. The left one. That is the sun. The one it's it kind lower. of like leaning left. <laughs> yeah, with lines. Lower from here. Yeah. With lines of colors. Yeah. The base is more white. You need a bolt to break it at 14, and you just don't feel it. I didn't know that was. Okay. So that's his camp too. No, do you see that rocks in uh -huh. the cold between? Mm -hmm. That is more or less a half of the way between come one and come two. The okay. captives on the other side. Yeah. We're doing a little uh, rest day, light hike. Checking out a cool little lagoon over here. We're gonna head over to see some penitentes, which are these ice. Tins. Tempting packs and Russ and Joe, you join us on the hike? Tempting to put your fingers in it to see how cold it is. Look at the moraine over here on the right, that's yeah. all ice. Doing our map, a trek up to Bonete Peak this morning. That's an organization hike. We got a seven hour round trip.
it is. Broken the record for me. <laughs> oh, you just broke it, huh? New PR. <laughs> Every step's the PR from here on out. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I did it again. Another one. Another one. This is it, the new PR. Yeehaw. God put that there for me. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's yeah. perfect. It's like a lazy boy in the woods for 15,000 feet. Gearing up for our helmets right now. So I mean, uh, last part to the top of Bonete is a little more technical. Cathedral Peak over here, this one's 17,000 feet high. Good with top. You had no sleep last night, right? that we need this system, just for security, okay? Do you want me to belay the bottom of the rope? No, it's, it's okay. For a whole hour, all I was thinking 
about on the way down was hot chocolate, hot chocolate, hot chocolate. Nice, you got it. <laughs> <laughs> and I got it. Here? This. Something about hot chocolate. I don't know. I usually have to pick a food. You know, sometimes after I find a 15 minutes, I'm going to eat a hamburger. Yeah, it's going to be the best hamburger. It's after you find a 16 or you want to. I want my hot chocolate. <laughs> I already got some in here. No. I got my submarine. And the hot chocolate is when you put like the other one, the. Aren't you guys glad I came on this trip with you? Otherwise, you wouldn't know about hot chocolate. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I gotta stir this thing up. Oh, I tear like the whole top. I can eat it with it. <laughs> and then fill the rest up here. <laughs> down, I'll some more down, down, down it goes. <laughs> now pay him. Sure? Now you stir. Here, let me stir. Oh, look how much nicer it looks. <laughs> oh, let me put more hot water to top it off. And then you'll get it. Don't worry. Oh, he's drinking the hot shaki in his traditional way. Oh, cheers. cheers. That's right. We bagged a mountain. We bagged a mountain in the Andes. Yeah. And it's Chris's personal best. Yeah, Chris. To Chris. Look at where we are. Hey, congratulations. <laughs> Boiling hot. Yeah, and it's we're on really the bottom cold. For tomorrow, go on back to Camp One is around four or five hours. No, the day we move to Camp One is around three four hours. The day they move to Camp Two is five six hours. The day they move to Camp Three is around four hours. Summit day is between go on back between 9 and 15 hours. No? 9, super very good time. 15 hours is okay. Is it not, you mean 9 to get to the top and back? Or N 9? Between to get 9 to the and top? 15, go and back. Okay. But probably, we normally make between 12 and 13 hours. 
So it's going to take us eight hours for a walk to the summit. Is that Camp 3, Summit, Summit back down to Mulas? No, to Camp 3. Fact, so this okay. day we come down to Mulas. So we day. sleep at Camp 3 again? Yeah. That night, okay. Um, day that we move from Camp 3 to Plaza de Mulas is three, four hours around. No? And the day that we move from here to Orcones, to the entrance, is between seven and nine hours. Mm -hmm. This day is very important, if we can have it. No? It's going to be also active rest day. We're going to walk around the camp. Probably we're going to find some water. But if we skip this day, we have one, two, three, four, five, six days in a row moving. No? You know, it's a little bit of news. Um, Chet is sick. Chet is sick? Uh, you're vomiting. It's oh, alright. No. Oh, she is? Yeah. Oh, no. It's alright. Just now. Yeah. Uh, I got the bucket. And so the bucket's in there. And she's fine now. Mm -hmm. um, and uh, got her some water. But I just told her I'd tell you. And so anyway, that's, all, that's all I'm doing at the moment. She's, right. feeling, she's feeling better. She's feeling better? Yeah. yeah. But I left the bucket there in case she needs to go again. Mm -hmm. Okay. Ali, ¿le puedes dar un poquito agua? Sí, pero ya está el cepro. Dale un minuto. Sí, sí, sí. 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 Sí, sí, sí.
no matter what in the mountains we must think that it's windy all the time even if it's not no? so <laughs> what do we do with the bike have somebody put a rock on it exactly rock. <laughs> <laughs> Look how much we're helping. Yes. <laughs> oh, we always must try to walk with gloves, but just in case, if we don't, if we need the hand, we put it here. We don't leave it there. We can lose it, no? Even if you put a rug or whatever, it could be cold. So, put inside the jacket. We have a simple knot, no? Here, nothing here. <laughs> <laughs> Ta <-da! laughs> and after we put around the room. There are different ways to put it. Easiest, like this. We always push. And after we have these hooks, this is the moment where we must close everything for two reasons. Because this could be like a, a like a balloon or like a bubble for the wind, and also because when we put the roof, we're going to tie the tent. If it's tied and the zip is open. This moment is going to be difficult to close. Yeah. 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 And now we try. You understand? Yes. And the letter must go around the pole. If you put it far away, look the distance you will have between this part of the gen. That distance means that we could have wind and snow. We close it. That distance is decreasing. And after here, and this label we have here, so we can put some more rocks and we close this area. We use this festival for a kitchen no? so we have the stove and we make it hot water and we have another door for going and out you can do whatever you want you can use this for going or head out or another one and you can use the festival as a warehouse no? you can put the backpack and everything here boots whatever what's your guess how much water did you have? Mm, He's gonna guess. I'm saying 22 kilos. 16. 16? Yeah. So it only but I still have to add my camera, my yeah. bathroom kit, and. But you added and two, one kilo I added one, water? No, I added one water to it. And you add one kilo? Yeah. Okay. Because I gotta add two water bottles to mine. Yeah, hey, let me weigh mine, Chris. So I'll be probably around 40 pounds. Don't know, which is about what I had last time. So I'll be good. Right. So we have a deal, right? Yeah, yeah, perfect. This isn't very heavy. What is that? Eight. Eight Nine. Nine. Eight? Nine? Yeah. yeah, that's awesome. That's not bad at all. That's not bad at all. Uh, you want to bring my... Have you, have you, have you have your water in there? Five. Um, no, two. I don't have my water in there, but so I'll... You have two uh, liters two, of water. Two liters of water. Okay, you later. Okay? Okay. Seven... Seven thirty. Seven thirty. Seven thirty. An hour or so, we're going to be heading up to Four Good to Camp One, leaving base camp. 
That might be hard to carry with a broken strap. <laughs> you have a broken strap? No, I just done done. Oh, you see my things come unglued here. Pax is warming up in the sun. <laughs> Chelsea's brushing her teeth, feeling much better now. <laughs> yeah, she didn't look like she had E. coli a day ago. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Robert is locked and loaded. Underwear. Yeah. Everybody got underwear. No. Crap. Eighty-five kilos. Jesus. Yeah. <laughs> it's all like this like long tube. It's yeah. all it's tube all pillows in backpack. there. It's all pillows. It's all pillows. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> kind of is. Packs all down pillows. down jackets. He likes all his comfort. All the food. <laughs> yeah. Susie's got ninety-five kilos. Yeah. Right. A bunch of gold bricks in there. Oh no, I'm Any chance to eat sausage? Yeah. A tent and a dinner. Give a minute, we are going to see who, which one has our, our tents. Okay, okay. If you want to take out the back, I'm going to jug it. Thinking that's our dome, what do you think? <laughs> you think so? Yeah. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> we'll give it away. <laughs> Alright, camp one. 
otherwise known as Camp Canada. Yuka's got a nice little dome. They set that up two days ago, which is awesome. That's where they'll be cooking at. And Russ and Chelsea are in that tent. Pax and Susie over here. Hello! This is our tent. <laughs> it's a little bit downhill. <laughs> and this is my tent for the night. And then Robert and Maryland are in this guy. The dirt was a pretty. nice chair, isn't it? Yeah, it is. You yeah. need it? No, I'll use this. Okay. Set you on. Is that cheese? Debbie, Chris said he's gonna eat cheese. <laughs> <laughs> I haven't done it yet. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna hide his food and only have cheese available. <laughs> <laughs> you would snacks. do that, wouldn't you? Oh, yeah. oh. There's snacks, guys. Put my booties on. <laughs> ah. That's a, that is also my puffiness. Puffy marshmallows. You're going to do it good for me. Solid. It's good. It's good? Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's, it's good. It's vegan. Mm -hmm. Ah. Well, I just like holding it. <laughs> I know. Thank you. Well, you must open my. I don't want to put. I don't think I'll be able to eat all of this though. <laughs> oh, it's so hot. Oh, look at picture that. picture for Nadir. <laughs> National Geographic. I'm digging for the potatoes. I found one. I'm a litter. Potato treasure. Yes! Zoom! <laughs> of really hot. Ari in the front, Susie hot on her heels, this is coming up to camp two. Poor Chris is sick, he's got nausea, either from E. coli or he was carrying a huge amount of weight there earlier in the day, going fast, maybe it was that, you know, hammerman working too hard. Hey Ari, hey, hey. our fearless leader. Yeah, guys. Russ doesn't look tired. He does Chelsea. Yeah, tired <laughs> yeah, and there's poor Chris, able to hike and puke at the same time. <laughs> Chris, you're on camera. You better speed up. <laughs> Reached the top of the sad saddle. We did not. Still on our way to camp two, feels like we're only halfway. We're gonna make it. Oh, it's a stroll. Well, if that's a, if you're Rush, his new nickname is Rush. It's no longer Russ. Here we go. Camp two, baby. There's Ari, our guide, Chris Chillaxon. Somebody else's camp. 
summit. He doesn't want to fly, does he? Yeah! Boy, well, he barely get himself off the ground. Woohoo! Oh, that was great! We do another 2,000 to get to camp three. Whoa! Mary Lynn couldn't get a shot up here. <laughs> what? Come get a shot up here. <laughs> So the heights. The rubber boot I just want them to like hang around. Thing. And I think with crampons, so well, you won't be wearing crampons. Water, it fun. Gracias. Mm. Oh, great. Thank you. Oh, yeah. yeah. Wow. <laughs> Too bad. Oh. I'll get a minute. Say, oh, great leader. <laughs> Gracias, oh, great leaders. <laughs> okay. I could, I hit it. Uh, Probably mm. they're not like it. Very, very hot, but it's impossible. They're perfect. <laughs> good, good, thank you. Uh, is there hot water hanging around somewhere, yeah. guys? Mm, I like that marinara. It's it ketchup. Is it ketchup? <laughs> but it goes good. Yeah. I'm like, oh, that tastes good. Wait a second. That reminds me of ketchup. Yum. Mm -hmm. Toss it to the middle. Is what you're doing. You always to juggle. Yeah, you're not. You never juggle yeah. it to the outside. It's always juggle it to the inside. Yeah, but yeah, the and key is it. And it's really cross practice. You know, okay. the first thing you always learn to do. Oh, you want to be yeah, able just to even that'd be difficult. Yeah. That's the thing. So far, we think that probably we're going to use the front post a little bit. Let's we'll see you tomorrow. We're going to ask her ask about our guide who is summited uh, today. Summit today to see how it was for them. No. We're going to follow our uh, professional advice. And no matter what, we're going to continue with this event. If they tell us, then it's not necessary. Until come through, we're going to carry it. <coughs> they gotta put the crampons with one knee in the ground. So I put one knee in the ground, I open the crampons, and I Work like that. And okay. always uphill? Yes, always okay. like that. Mm. Yeah. You wouldn't know how to put them on. This ring mm -hmm. must be here. Not here, not here. The idea is try to use as much as the quantity of points as possible. Normally it's 10. It's difficult to use 12. The second rule is imagine they have three legs. No? Okay. So we have imaginary legs and we are not going to walk like this because it's impossible because we have three legs. So we have give a room 
for the leg we have in the middle. And we're going to put a third one that is two step distance with the guy we have in the front. Just in case if the one who's walking, he's, uh, he's got to start again, you got to make two steps back. If I'm very close, the crampons are going to scratch my leg. Even with our weight, if I put the crampon in the ice or in the, in the snow, just passing my weight from one foot to another is enough. Some places we must walk with crampons in the ground. If you have 100 meters of ground and after we have snow again, we are now going to take off the crampon for 100 meters. You know? So I can to walk in the ground and the rocks over there. Right? Follow me, please. We are not going to make a Ice climbing, just walk a little bit. I'm going to show you a couple techniques for go up and down, and that's all, right? <laughs> Sometimes it's impossible to put the 10 points at the same time, so we gotta make this movement. I gotta go open the legs like if I'm drunk, no? So imagine that we're walking like this, and we're gonna open the leg. Open. Open it. We can open the feet. No? One looking for every side. If not, then not like she said. Both looking for the same size. But Remember the third leg, right? We are getting everything ready for our move from camp two to camp three today. Behind Until your heart explodes. Can people's heart just... explode? <laughs> I really don't want my heart to explode. <laughs> I don't want to see that either. No. You acted on a whole really well, I think. I seem to be okay, yeah. Born in Colorado. <laughs> Well, wait a second, there's seven of us. And then they have two more, right? Very good. But Pax, oh, so six. Pax is easy when it's played at one. Help me! 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 700 layers that I have on right now. Yay! Team Chelsea work. had to turn around because she couldn't put her shit on. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I couldn't put my lobster claws on. We're off to camp three.
<laughs> That's a 19,000 foot jump. Every step now is a PR. I think we're all still doing good. I can still do my kick. <laughs> You're higher than Killy now. Yep. Hi. <laughs> nice I've ever been. Yeah. Pretty cool, huh? Good trail. Oh yeah. I'm so high. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yes, right here. There, Chris. So we're above the summit of Killy. Yeah, I am above. Fix you. <laughs> So, yeah, I feel um feel really strong, not tired at all, the slightest. But I'm like kind of like, woo, kind of shaky. Yeah. Okay. yeah, it's like like not balanced. I just feel weird. Just feel weird. You are weird, Pat. <laughs> Weirder than. I think I was gonna make it. Yeah. Thank you. 6,000 meters. Tomorrow. Very good run. Thank you. Good job. Good job. Good job. Good job. Okay, you pick. You're 6,000 meters. Chelsea. Yeah. You're picked. Chris, let's see how to put the camera about right there, close up. Okay, I'm gonna do 10,000 of these. <laughs> Hold on. I'm doing full ones. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yes. It's unfinished business. All the stuff in my tent was an effort, but I feel pretty good. And uh, Ika made us some nice appetizers to eat. That was really very, very good, considering the altitude we're at. And uh, I'm gonna rest, take a little bit of a rest, and we have dinner around like six or seven, I think. And it's lights out, and we get up at 
3.30. I think we're on the chill by 4.35. whole day and it's going to be a long day but you came for this so don't give up yeah? one thing is push the limit and another thing is cross <laughs> the limit no probably everybody understand what is the difference sorry i cannot see a little bit <laughs> was that better yeah okay, okay. you lose the feel 40 percent of the heat about your head. So, <clears throat> i told you guys uh, my advice try to save any all of energy that you have no for tomorrow go to sleep now i know you could be anxious but try to relax and try to sleep sorry we are going to spend more time making noise probably uh, we have all the guys we have a day of 48 hours with a nap in the middle we're just going to sleep a few hours but don't worry about that right but i need that you go to sleep and relax how is the idea for tomorrow? At four, we are going to give you the um, hot water for breakfast, one liter per person. And <clears throat> after a few minutes before five, try to don't make two minutes before five, like a 15 minutes before five, come to the dump and we're going to refill all the waters. <laughs> one, <laughs> two, three, go! Two, wash your marshmallows! <laughs> Thank you. Nalgene? You want an Nalgene? Thermo? Your Nalgene or, or Thermo? Where is it? Yeah. Uh, wind is blowing like really strong outside. And uh, four in the morning we got breakfast, hot water. And I guess we're still gonna attempt this mountain today, so we'll see what happens. Here you go. Yeah? Summertime. You guys ready? Helmet and ground ones? Yes, ma'am. Sunglasses. How do you feel, guys? Good. How do you feel? Another day in the office. <laughs> yep. Alright, let's do this. Woo! Bonus. Here we go.
tracks. How are you feeling? Okay. I'm feeling pretty nice good. Stuff. I feel a little dizzy. Not too bad. Yeah. Hot. Yeah. I'm roasting in this jacket. That last bit was... Yeah, my heart rate started to open up. Adi, 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 Adi. Oh no. Adi, Adi, Adi. No, 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 I know it's tough, sorry, but it's safety. Yeah? This is your summit, all right? Sorry, my friend, but it's not coming the easiest. Yeah, I have, now, to, I have to slow way, way down. Yeah, but now it's like we talk, we're talking with safety. Yes, yes. Sorry, guys. <laughs> Sometimes you, you run out of oxygen. <laughs> <laughs> Literally. <laughs> I love you, Dad. I love you. Don't worry. I love you also. Boy, thanks. That's usually a custom of the hug and people talking. <clears throat> Is that magic tea? Yeah, with three kilos of sugar, more or less. Oh. Uh, anything that I have that you want? I don't think so. Snacks or anything? I got my own. Okay. <clears throat> la, la, la. Hola, Monegra. Dale, ya vi la radio. Gracias, loca, eh. You are. You are go. Okay, guys. Okay. Good luck. Thank you. Russell, we'll see you back at three. Camp three. <laughs> Thank you.
breathing. There's Chris. He put me on the task of looking to the top so we could get this video. I hate it. I'm dying. <laughs> Woo! Those last steps are tough, aren't they? I almost fell over. Yeah! Say it, Tito! Tito, what, number 24 for you? Oh man, you slacker. That's <laughs> awesome. Unbelievable. There's our photographer, our videographer, yeah. Bring it home, Chris. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, man. Woo! So hard, to... We did it. So hard. Good talk, guys. Oh. Good Big round of the hug, dude. Thank you. 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 Thank I don't even know. <laughs> yeah, I can't believe I did that. <laughs> You're rocking, man. I can't believe you did it to the top. You put that kind of effort towards something, it's just the top. It's South America. Oh. We're playing for a year, I got an extra job. <laughs> put all the equipment, and here we are. <laughs> it's pretty good. <laughs> I can't believe I did this. I think it was the hardest thing I ever did. <laughs> but, um, <laughs> yeah, he's like videotaping me talking to you right now. We're so tired, we haven't been able to get our cameras out yet. China, India, Felicitaciones, Wow! ¿Cuántas son? Cuatro. Thanks, Dad. Okay. Chris and Paxton want to play football on the top of Aconcagua. <laughs> I don't know if you've noticed, but there's a lot of rocks up here. Nice. The wind died down. 
sticker drafted and crafted months before we came up here now we're representing <laughs> as he breaks across <laughs> Down below. Yeah, let's yeah. go. Let's go. Let's do it. Feeling a little tipsy? <laughs> you nudged oh, no. the slightest bit, dude. Good job. Woo! Nice. Oh, buddy, camp three. He's got the same pack as I do. Nice. Yeah. So they never had to carry it because they had to carry it the whole time. Have you ever carried an entire <laughs> canvas in your pack before? No, definitely not. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That is you. Yeah, you're right. Probably is. Right? He's using it right now for you. Base camp. Well done. Oh, oh, hey, 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 Thank you. 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 We don't have bananas, we have tarta. What is it? Tarta. Oh, that's that's good. Good. Wow, that's like so. See the one with the corn and it's drawing me in. I love the best. Yeah, he does. Yeah, he does. Yeah, His favorite. I don't think he does. Is that what he is? I'm not going to be very good. Oh, I don't want that. I don't want that. game I want to play. Oh, I love alcohol so much. <laughs> <laughs> First of all, we are here representing all the stuff, and we are glad that you choose us 
to do this fantastic experience, this fantastic adventure. And uh, I, we hope that you feel like home and you feel like our family because we are like our family here. So congratulations all of you. And uh, each summit is different and each mountain is different. So I'm glad that you had a good experience. Very good time. Good? Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Salud. 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 Guys, for my part, I'm saying thanks a lot to help us to help you really uh, maybe sometimes you don't know what's happening behind this of the scene so i want to say thanks a lot to the guys here and also <laughs> yeah. 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 thank you very much yes. i enjoyed all, all the days with you oh, good yeah likewise thank you. i know you do your best some people reach the highest point of the mountain so people find the personal summit like she said like we said before and but like i told you we are glad that everybody's safe and sound here back again okay thanks guys thank you <laughs>
70. What was your other was one? 82.6. Okay. So what I don't know what that is. Five almost? Oh, that's like me, yeah. Five kilos. I lost five kilos. Wait, what is five kilos in pounds? 2.2. Two. So I had 70, well, I had 78 kilograms yeah, before. Oh, over 10 pounds. We oh. lost 12 pounds. So 73 versus 78. Oh, nice. Five. We all lost about 10 pounds. Damn, you're awesome. Hold on, see. That's awesome. Four kilos, exactly. Four kilos. <laughs> this guy's got into a science. <laughs> science.